They're tough, they're trim, they're sexy and slim. But which of them is going to win a TV aerobics off? Heavenly bodies are coming your way. Next. HBO's research department discovered why good girls go bad. Bad language. Art. Bad manners. Bad posture. Bad shoes. And bad company. On this advice, HBO's programming department discovered bad girls who made good. It can happen. Ellen DeGeneres. People always ask me, were you funny as a, as a child? And, uh, no. I was an accountant. Paula Poundstone. I would imagine that the wages of sin are death. But by the time they take taxes out, it's just kind of a tired feeling, really. We don't run her. I had to quit the ballet after I injured a groin muscle. It wasn't mine. And Judy Tenuta. And I love to hunt. <laughs> because I like to wear safety orange. And some guy who wants to be in programming. Discover what we did. What made them so bad is what makes them so good. People mean nothing to me. On location, Women of the Night, Friday on HBO. Strike up the band. For ten years, HBO's been parading young comics into your home. And now it's time to celebrate, Pilgrim. I don't believe it. Because we've got an honor roll of our top alumni emceeing HBO's Young Comedians All-Star Reunion. The celebration so big, it spills across wide comedy campuses. People, people, people. From Boston, it's Stephen Wright. Oh, no. From Toronto, it's Blast Blavon. Howie Mandel. How's it going, Ace? From the mean streets of New York, it's Richard Belzer. Which is rumored to be a very unsafe city. Let me just... From Los Angeles, it's Harry Anderson. And San Francisco's favorite son, Robin Williams. It's a scary thing. And there's more. We'll feel the cream of this year's Young Comedians graduating class for HBO's Gala Young Comedians All-Star Reunion. HBO, your summer entertainer, bringing it home all summer long. has been rated R by the Motion Picture Association of America. It is intended for mature audiences. Parents may wish to consider whether it should be viewed by children under 17.